Hey guys, it's Paul, and as you can see, I am someplace very tropical and nice. I am in Tampa, Florida. Uh, why? Well, I am down here at uh, the University of Maine uh, Advanced Star Design Composite Center. We were invited down to do some presentations on 3D printing, so we did that, and uh, the boat builders seemed to really enjoy our presentations. They had a lot of really good questions. We had shipped down a, a Creality CR-10S Super. Uh, we bought that from Tiny Machines and we had that up and running so that a couple of the boat builders had their designs as finalists. And what we did is once they cleaned them up in CAD so that we could 3D print them, we 3D printed them. So sorry I haven't posted any videos in a little while, but as you can see, we've been really, really busy. Right now, I'm enjoying the fact that it's 91 degrees, it's probably 70% humidity, and knowing that I think right now back home in Maine, it's probably 49 degrees. So enjoying this new job, enjoying the travel. I uh, wasn't expected to be doing presentations, but my boss said I did an outstanding job and that I'm a natural. Must be all these YouTube videos. And uh, <clears throat> so far, it's been a great time. And what I did is I did a whole bunch of video clips here just walking through and if any of you guys are boaters or have that interest, holy cow, this place has everything. There was a lot of demonstrations, there was a lot of uh, stuff on display. One of my favorites was stopping by the Igus table because I bought a lot of stuff from them in the past for various, for the R2 d build. Um, I used a couple of sliders for the center leg motion and of course they have a lot of uh, materials that you can use in 3D printing. Um, I didn't realize this whole 3D printing materials, but that was fun to see. And of course they have the cable chains and the wiring and sliders and you name it, they had it. So there is that. So anyway, that's what I've been up to. Hopefully I'll be home, be able to settle down a little bit. Uh, I did do a whole bunch of printing over the last weekend in preparation for the show. And uh, I can tell you right now, I really need to devote some time to my FT6. I definitely have some upgrades I need, need to do on that printer and a couple of my other ones. I'm really impressed with the CR-10S Super that came from Tiny Machines. Uh, the CR-10S Super is essentially what they've done is uh, it comes with their polypropylene bed. It has a micro source 0.6 nozzle on it. They have Capricorn tubing. They are using an EZR extruder and it has a 32-bit operating system. And it also has the BL touch. And basically they also send you, uh, when you purchase that printer, the uh, profiles uh, for Simplify 3D and it made setting that printer up and getting it up and running super easy. Um, had no issues with bed leveling, uh, everything's been great. So I know this kind of sounds like a commercial for Tiny Machines 3D, but I gotta tell you, if you're looking to get a printer, don't have one already, the CR-10S is a great printer to start with. And for a little bit more money, it's all upgraded for you. I really recommend checking that printer out. We've been printing nonstop with it all uh, the last two days and uh, it's been a great experience. All right, so that's it for now. As always, I thank you guys for watching. Keep tracking me on social media. I'm on Facebook, where Nerdy is Cool, Instagram, and even Twitter. And of course, the website is where nerdyiscool.com. If you aren't a subscriber, make sure you hit the button and become one so you don't miss any of my cool videos. And for now, I'm gonna wrap this up. I'm gonna enjoy the sunshine. Me and my pasty white skin are gonna get a little bit of sun. And uh, until next time, have a good one. Oh, I'm sorry, that's not what you're expecting. You're expecting this is where Nerdy is Cool. Take care, guys.